We here at Algrix have been working really hard listening to feedback from our customers, and many of them have requested better support for working with large and complex models. So this is what we've been focusing on lately, and I will now show you what improvements we've made to the plugin. Here we have a quite complex model of a ship, and in this instance we want to simulate this crane here. And the first new feature I'd like to show you is this one called Color by Body. And this is a really useful tool to have when troubleshooting large models. And to show you how it works, let's press simulate and see what happens. As you can see, there's something going on here in this area with all the contact points. And if we press color by body, all the rigid bodies in the scene are assigned a different color. And this is to help uh, separate them visually. So now we can easily see that this wheel actually resides in the same rigid body as the ship. And that's not what we want. So let's select these three and press merge. And let's simulate this one more time. Oops, forgot that one. But uh, as you can see, it works a lot better now. Color by Bodies is a really simple tool that helps tremendously when dealing with these large models. We've also made big improvements to the collision detection system for more stable mesh-mesh contacts. Another big usability improvement we have done is the ability to group rigid bodies in the simulation structure. If we were to simulate this crane and the one in the back and uh, this one as well, the simulation structure would quickly be, become cluttered. And to help deal with that problem we can now group these rigid bodies. And to do that you simply shift select them, right click and add to new group. Call this one crane1. One. And uh, this way you can keep your simulation structure neat and organized. Another new feature is that we now support Keyshot materials, making the workflow Model Simulator Render even more efficient and quick. We can now define all the materials directly in SpaceClaim and these will follow along when we export the Keyshot. In addition to these new features, we've also taken care of some bugs and made some big speed up improvements. Thanks for watching.